Okay, so global doesn't have him yet, but one unit that's very good that's gonna come. Uh, oh man, it's it's so uncertain to when he's coming for global because if you look at the schedule, he's the fourth next summable unit. If you, like if you look at the GP schedule, it's uh, Helbrum, Red Merlin, uh, Blue Galland, and then uh, Escanor in the end. And like Escanor is the fourth next unit to come. And it's like, is he really going to be the fourth one? Because it took like months for him to release on GP, like four months or something. Uh, I, won't, I could be wrong with that. But it took him a few months to release on GP, so I don't know how fast he will be releasing on global, but man, he's a goddamn good unit. And when he releases, you gotta summon for him. But before we get into some matches, I'm gonna play some PvP today with him, because he, he is really good on PvE as well, don't get me wrong, but he is mainly a PvP unit, and he was really goddamn good at it. Let me make, it, let me make the, uh, the expression for the thumbnail. Oh yeah, this one. I like this one. Okay, uh, there's a lot of teams that Green Escalor is really good at, and this is one of them, which is the King, Escalor, Gopher, and, and Merlin combo. In the turn one, I already have both Escalor and Gopher's ultimate if I want to. Mm, what should do? What should do? Let's see what he does. Uh, 117k CP. He might be using... I'm sorry. Combat class. He might be using combat class food. I don't know. Um. Okay. Let me go for this. This is gonna get go for his ultimate. And then I'll just attack uh, Meliodas. And that's Meliodas and, and Ascomer's ultimate. I mean, I'm sorry. Go for it and Ascomer's ultimate. So one of the reasons why he's so good is because a full ult cage removes uh, debuffs and like that, just like that he removed that debuff. And his ultimate is a uh, one shot in anyone, like literally a one shot in anyone. Oh, please don't take off my ult cage. Okay, he might he might be able to take off my ult cage actually. Yeah, he took it off. That's a shame. Um, what to do next then? I'm going for Ascanor, of course. What to do next? Ooh. Okay, you know what? Okay. Boom. I'm petrifying you, so you can't take off old cage again and healing. So that's I have an ultimate for everyone. <laughs> uh, this match I'm not even using Yasuko. I'm just going for old. I mean, to be honest, when I record videos, I do want to go for you know, if especially when I'm showcasing, I want to go for getting a good look of the unit. But sometimes I just want to win, you know. <laughs> sometimes I just want to win. Let's see if this guy didn't, doesn't have that many DML cards. Oh, don't have a level 2 or something? That's gonna survive. Okay, he survived! Good! Oh, the sliver! Okay. Um. Pom, pom, and. Pom. And that should be it. Oh, I think Red Ascular does. Uh, Red Ascular definitely survives, but. Oh. And then look at the damage on Green Ascular's ultimate. This is ungeared PvP, so not even counting gear or anything. Nope, no fate combo or anything, or uh, I guess link combo, whatever. Ikimos! And I have to ult gauge back, but this guy. Oh man, if he wasn't using this Red King, I would be doing so much more damage. That's a shame. The AoE might kill me, actually. No! Don't have any AoE. He definitely. Do oh. Don't kill King, don't kill King! The Red King in the back completely messed me up. Alt? Ooh. I can still win. <laughs> I'm gonna cut this match even if I win or lose because it's gonna take a while, but I can still win. I'm pretty sure I won this. Um, I'm sorry that the first match didn't have the best showing of Escanor. I got... Not that I got unlucky, but it was... When you face this specific team that I just faced, which is the, uh, the blue melee team, you really need to be, like, safe. And not go for like risky plays, or else they just molly whop you with the amount of damage they do. But um, I ended up winning because this team that I just used is like really good. It's like really solid and easy to make. Just ask Escanor, of course, is a summonable unit, but if you like, if you save gems for him and you pull him, he's like super useful. Merlin's coin shop, go for his, his coin shop, and then King is also coin shop. Uh, King is free. <laughs> you don't have a coin shop, you get him for free. So it's like the team is super free to play friendly. Only summonable unit needed is Escanor. But yeah, let me finish this guy off and move on to the next match. Next match, I'm going to use him more. I'm going to take off the ult food, and instead of going for ult, I'm going to just go for, like, doing, like, damage of Ascular. That, that, that should be what I should be doing. Alright, let's see who's next. And King Brum, fun. Ooh, wait. Okay. Oh, I could have used ult food. He, had low, he has low CP. Okay. Perfect. 
Let me show you one of the biggest qualities of Askenor. It's this. I have his ultimate. <laughs> First turn in, I already have his ultimate. Let's do abusing avoid food. Nice. Oh, I wish I could kill him like this. But I have his ultimate. Uh, the only way he can stop me is if he uses Hellbird to take off ultimate, which he totally can. But that's just a scary thing. Because, uh... oh, they added something? A visual effect? Or am I crazy? No, it's a, it's a guy's head. Am I stupid? <laughs> am I stupid? Okay. That was just a... Dude, I swear like it looked like a buff. That's so stupid. Alright, let me attack you. Uh, this should kill Kane. And then let me get go for his ultimate. Attack seal, so Hellborn can't take off ult gauge anymore. And then this should kill King. And just a normal attack from Gopher again. Boop. And that's Ascular's ultimate. And Ascular doesn't care about type disadvantage, by the way. Oh, if he gets a Merlin card, he can take off my ult gauge. But he can probably only take off the ult gauge of one person. So he's gonna have to choose either Gopher or, Merlin or uh, Ascular. I would go for Ascular personally. And he did! Nice. Nice for him. Alright, buddy. Um, oh, he's gonna. It, okay, I, it made sense for him to petrify King because if he didn't petrify King, I would just unpetrify myself easily. Okay, okay, okay. I need to think of this. Uh, boom, boom. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Maybe go for the kill. Because uh, Ascanor, his card increases damage by 10%. So hopefully this will be enough to kill. Oop. It wasn't. Unfortunate. But he took off, took off his ult. So that's what matters. Hopefully he can take off my, my ult gauge so I can finally ult. Man, I swore this guy's head was like a, a, a yellow buff. Because uh, buffs are not yellow. Buffs are red. But... When uh, when there's like a yellow thing, it's like a stance. I, I thought it was a stance because Ascanor, when he has full ult gauge, he becomes immune to any, bu any uh, buffs and debuffs. That, that could be a stance. Wait, actually, I'm gonna kill Helbrum. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna kill Helbrum. And then this might even kill Gopher. I, I ranked it up because um, at level 2, the Ascanor thing it removes buffs and the shields count as buffs. I think, I don't know if every shield counts as a buff, but this shield specifically does. Yeah, broke the shield. Ah, it didn't kill. It's fine though, it was type disadvantage. Maybe if it was like type advantage or something, we would have killed. This match is done. Um, and against Kingbrim, dude, Kingbrim is so annoying. When, when Hellbrim comes to global in like... I don't know how long, it shouldn't take too long. But whenever Hellbrim comes to global, you're gonna feel him. You really are. Oop, oop, this should kill. You know what? I'm gonna kill Merlin just because I I, I don't know if Gopher would die to the first Ascanor attack and I would have to attack Gopher twice and with a level 3. So I'll just do the damage on Merlin. Yukimasu. Boom. <laughs> Ungeared, dude. And he has the ultimate again because his card is so stupid with getting ult gauge and stuff. It's just so good. It is so good. Yeah, let me move on to the next match. Just after we watch this. Uh, this is uh, a super attack animation that looks really cool. Alright, who are we getting next? Ooh, this is my team actually. So, this. No, not my team. <laughs> Claiming ownership, but I love running this team. So, um, it's very easy to counter, especially if you have, if you have Ascular. I know this because it's, it's a team that I use, right? So, you do this, and this, and. Um, actually, okay, okay, okay. So. I'm gonna go for ranking him up twice and attacking, because I feel like it's actually better. It's gonna do more damage, so... Yukimasu. Not, it probably isn't gonna kill King, but it's gonna be like really close. To the point where he needs to heal and waste the healing card. And then... Give me a rank up. <sighs> a shame. I can just kill his Asterosa. Because he's gonna use a taunt, so I can kill his Asterosa. I'm still gonna take his ultimate though. Oh, he's not gonna heal. Because he needs to get someone's ultimate. Oh, he's not gonna heal. You stupid! You stupid, you should've healed. Maybe he couldn't. No, he, he definitely could. But now Escanor is gonna kill you. 
and kill you. So, uh, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> Daddy Ascalo is gonna teach you how to be. Boop! And then, goodbye, king. Ooh, son. Yeah, you better just quit. <laughs> I'll just quit right now. I'll genuinely just quit. There's nothing he can do right now. Yep, just quits. Alright, I think this will be the last one. Ends against penetration again. Oh, this time I have a higher, the higher CP. Because the first one... was the first match, right? I think, yeah. Um, I did have a lower CP. Alright, so I wore attack, ceiling, and petrifying you. It was the better play than using Escalor. Um So, uh, again, for... for uh, this is not a showcase showcase video, because this unit is kind of old, but... Um, I like using the unit as much as possible, but if I'm in a situation where using something else is better, I'll just use something else. <laughs> I'll just use something else. He's gonna go for the, oh, he's gonna force the ultimate. I see. I see. Mm. Okay. So I'm gonna give you a um, a counter response. I'm gonna get two ultimates. So who you're gonna kill? You're gonna have to choose. I'll kill King. <laughs> If I had if I had to make the choice, I'd kill King because King is vastly superior. Oh, that level two card could be a healing, and that that unpetrifies uh, millions. He's one hundred percent gonna choose uh, King. That's just the safest bet. Um, and takes off the alt cage. Yeah, he's gonna kill King and take off the alt cage. Makes sense. Not getting the Ascanor cards really hurts though. Okay. Oh, he didn't. He couldn't take off the alt cage. Maybe he could, his next card. No, he couldn't. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, so Gopher should cover Meliodas right here. And then... And then I'm going for an Ascanor ultimate. This is a guaranteed Ascanor ultimate right here. Boom. And then boom. This is why... Dude, this is why... I want, this is one of the reasons why Ascanor is so broken. This card... That gets in the ult gauge... Is just so stupid. Because... If you combine cards, right, you get so much, so much alt gauge, and then the card gives you an alt gauge, so it's like guaranteed, like, to get the ultimate right here. It's so stupid. So good. Alright. Escalor should honestly be able to take off the rest of the round. Like, if... I'm, I'm goddamn sure he kills King. And then... If Lilia can die with just one Cruel Sun card... Oh, he's gonna kill Gopher. I lose one turn. If you kill Gopher, I'm gonna have to kill. Oh, okay, he healed as well. Never mind then. My, I'm gonna go for um, kill Askum because you're you're very strong, and then kill Lilia later because uh, then the King is gonna do what? Keep uh, attacking him with attacking with his uh, weak cards. Boop, and then kill your Lilia. She is dead, and the match is done. Askenor is so stupid. <laughs> um. There's people that say he's not a god tier unit, and I just don't get it. Alright, thank you guys, the match is done, so thank you guys for watching. When this comes out on Global, sell for him. It's kind of worth it, I would say.